Hi, this is Ian Cole bringing you an IEQA tech tip on calculating the dew point temperature using a psychrometric chart. You may have a device that calculates temperature and relative humidity, but what if you want to figure out the dew point temperature? Before I teach you a simple method using a psychrometric chart, let me first tell you why dew point temperature is something important to know. Dew point is a variable that tells us the conditions when airborne humidity will condense, potentially causing moisture and mold damage. Dew point also gives us an indication of how much actual humidity is in the air, which is something relative humidity doesn't do. So dew point, not relative humidity, is a better measure for evaluating a humidification or dehumidification system. If you've measured the temperature and relative humidity, how do you calculate the dew point temperature? <laughs> well, one way is to download an app for your smartphone or purchase a device that provides that measurement. I like calculating dew point with a psychrometric chart, which is freely available on the web. Just do an internet search to find one. Once you have one, I like to draw a thick vertical line through my temperature. Next, I draw a thick line through my relative humidity, which is represented by curved lines on the chart. I see where these two lines intersect, and I draw a dot. Then I draw a horizontal line through the dot and see where it intersects with the left side of the chart, which is called the saturation curve. I read the number on the saturation curve to get my dew point temperature. That's it. If you'd like to learn how to do more calculations on the psychrometric chart, consider taking the one-hour class in the IAQA University titled Using the Psychrometric Chart. Visit the IAQA website for more information.